But today I want to continue our Lenten series, Lenten the Car, by talking a little about merging traffic. You can see right now I'm merging over, so I got to put the signal on, I got to take a look to see who's who's coming here, and um, I got to get safely over here. And when we merge, it's kind of a reminder to us that, you know, we got to be careful. We're not the only ones on the road, and so we got to carefully signal and get ourselves over because uh, it's more than just about ourselves. And that's that whole idea of, you know, our loving our neighbor. You know, we're not the only ones here on earth. What Lent does, it kind of gives us an opportunity to, to reflect on a couple of questions. Um, how am I treating others? Um, how am I treating people maybe that I'll never see again? Uh, how about uh, those who are hard to love? And so in your Lenten assistance bag, you're gonna see in there the corporate works of mercy. And you know, that's a concrete way in which we love our neighbor. And to think about is there something we could do this Lent and Lent beyond, maybe to live out those corporal works of mercy. Also in your Lent assistance bag, you're gonna see, you're gonna find a rosary and maybe how to say it. Maybe what you can do is maybe say just one decade of the rosary. I'm gonna do maybe all five. Maybe, maybe you could do all five, but maybe you can just do one. Nice thing to be able to do in the car with your family. You know, put that rosary in your in your in your car, and then when your family's in there, maybe pass that rosary around. Everybody says a hail mary to get a deck of the rosary for those people who are who are hurting. So, well, thanks for joining us, and uh, look forward to seeing you this weekend. And this is Father Walsh, and I want to thank you for joining us for our Lent in a Car series. And you know, during this uh, season of Lent, I hope to uh, have you come here for some of our activities, you know, masses, penance, service, etc. We'd love to have you, and I make a special appeal if you've been away from our church, you're looking for a, a church, uh, think about joining us for Easter. It's a really good experience here at St. Pius, and the Easter message is something we all can really can hear. Thanks.